Drummer, composer, producer, Sarone is a multi-profile musician who has had an extraordinary fate. Crowned king of the dance floor, he is one of the originators of disco. He is one of the French artists who best held an international career during 32 years, always present in worldwide dance floors. Sharon has successfully managed to bring together the disco generation of the late 70s with fans of today's popular dance music genres, including dance music, house, and electronica. Today, he is generally considered as one of the most important musical influences. 1976. Sharon produces his first album, Love and C Minor, by himself after he was refused by the majors. He doesn't lose hope and presses 5,000 copies in England, which he will distribute himself in Paris. DJ plays Sarone's music in New York clubs. It is an immediate success. The track becomes an enormous hit in clubs and will be signed by Atlantic Records. The album will be sold at 3 million copies. Disco is born. At the same time, Sarone, he was his second album, Sarone's Paradise. He receives his first awards in the U.S., award for Best New Artist and Best Producer of the Year. In 1977, the release of the Super Nature album sold 8 million copies. He gets five awards from the Billboard Awards Ceremony. Best Male Artist of the Year, Best Composer of the Year, Best Instrumentalist of the Year, Best Arranger of the Year, and Best Producer of the Year. Super Nature, Love and C Minor are some of the hits that made Sarone famous worldwide. And they grew up in a way that we'd never seen before. Super Nature. Super Nature. Super Nature. The second single, Give Me Love, from the same LP, was also a huge hit. Just Sweet Music, new single from Sharon 4, The Golden Touch, reached gold status as soon as it was released in the United States. To celebrate the release of his new album, journalists from Europe and the United States were invited to a big showcase at Studio 54. Incredible. On the 2nd of December, 1978, Sharon creates a show in front of 12,000 people in Paris under a plexiglass pyramid of 16 meters large and 12 meters high. It's the beginning of his big event concerts. The concert choreography of the event provocates choking reactions. During the show, dozens of naked people were dancing on the stage. Wow.
1979, Sharon releases his fifth album, Angelina, with guest musicians from the band Toto. The sound of the album has rock influences. The same year, he receives two prestigious awards from the Grammys, Best Producer of the Year and Best Composer of the Year. In 1982, Sarone produces three albums, Sarone 7, You Are the One, Sarone 8, Backtrack, and Sarone 9, Your Love Survived. He gives concerts all around the globe, Japan, England, Germany, Italy, etc. Sarone 7, You Are the One, introduces a new talent, Miss Jocelyn Brown, who is well known in the dance community. I'm in a different way. 